Look at that. I see you. Wow, that's very messy. That was Noah. Hmm. Very interesting. Sign's real pretty on it. And then this is interesting. It's just like this hell and of course the darn sunlight but but look at this wall back here you have this wall and it runs like you can see it goes all the way over there of course the sunlight is blocking it but not wild and it makes you wonder what this was right here this little area where water is and they've got a metal pipe sitting in it, but yet there's stones around it, so I wonder what that was. Maybe. You can, see the, wash... you can see the top of the furnace right there. Maybe where they wash off that stuff. The... I don't know. But they would have driven the ore all the way up here and then dumped it in the top. But my question is, how would they have done that? Because. Maybe they, maybe they had a bridge. Well, yeah, they'd have had to have had a bridge because that's my thing. Is, it's not like iron ore is heavy, so it's not like you can sit here and just throw it over the top. Hey, Jim. Yeah. Maybe. How did they get to it? Did they have a structure built? Yeah, they had a bridge that went over it. So they had a bridge, okay. Or maybe even the, the, it, the mount, like the area right here got worn back There's over the top. There's a pretty river down there. <laughs> yeah. So the bridge is now gone. Huh. Pretty neat, huh? Mm -hmm. How many minutes has that been since we've been out here? Well, that darn sun, but it's really, really, really pretty. I wish I could get it without the sun. Oh, come on, sun. Oh, darn. That is so neat. But the sun's not going to cooperate. I can't get it any other different angle. Alright, so evidently that's a big piece of iron ore. Jory Beth, help up on that rock so we can see how big it is. Or, or at least put your hand on it. Okay. Turn your hand towards me. See? That's how big it is. And evidently it's really heavy. Let's see if I can even... Oh, golly! Okay, yeah, that's... That's a heavy piece of rock. Okay, I think I got it. So that's a piece of iron ore. That's what they used to put up in the top of that big structure right there. Look at this little weird piece of rock that I got on top of has these weird melt patterns. It's so funky. Cool. I got on top. Neat. Yeah. Was was there I don't remember, but on the very front of it, towards the river, was there another one of these arched, um, air, uh... No, there's only the three. There's three. Okay, so I didn't know there was... The one back here is practically filled in. The what? The one back here is practically filled in. Yeah. They all are. And here's the back side of it. <laughs> Look at those rocks. Those so are nail. so cool. Huh? So there's a nail shoved in right there. Yeah, you can see little, I don't know, tool marks of some sort. That is just fascinating. This is called the old furnace. It dates back to the 1800s, and, to look back at me and they're hey. supposed to be forming a park out of this, raising the funds. But we're fortunate enough to so, have uh, information to get back here. Still kind of a secret. And evidently, this structure used to be two stories high. There's a hill that's behind it, and as you can see, it's crumbling. But it used to be two stories high, and they put the iron ore down in the middle. And it would shoot down through this furnace and come out the bottom. And I'll go around to the front to show where the 
tell where the hole in the middle is. Your daddy's out there? He shouldn't he's be. Trying to find a car. I think he's in it. Daddy's being naughty. He should not be up there. Thing's not structurally sound. Okay. And there it is. Yep, there's Jim being naughty. He's not supposed to be up there. Boy, and unfortunately there's video evidence of the naughtiness. But that's the hole. It's hard to get perspective, but Jim is standing on the edge of the hole. Can you see down in the hole? No, it's still well, evidently all the rocks have filled in. And this thing is amazing. And then there's um, a river down there. I can barely see it. Mama, yeah. I found a little hideout where they some of that stuff. Like what? What do you mean? The green rocks we've been seeing? Like what? Yeah. There's just a lot little, of it. Yeah, there's just little deposits of it. of it everywhere. And that, see, what's interesting is that just looks kind of gray, but then some of the rocks that we found, like those two pieces we found over there, oh wow, that's pretty cool. Look at this starburst effect. Yeah. What? Look in the viewfinder. Yeah, I know it. I, I know it. Oh, How many? cool. <coughs> Look. Yeah, it's a one, star. two, three, four, five. It's a six bladed diaphragm. Star of Bethlehem. <laughs> star of hey! It's a family video, man. This is really neat. A little bit of history. Jory found hallucinogenic mushrooms. Look. <laughs> Save those for later. Yeah, we'll go up there. You okay, Jerry? You okay? Yeah, it's off. Thanks for your face. You really cannot get a perspective on Yeah, it really is kind of difficult to get perspective. You can see the... Yeah, you can see where the interiors crumbled in, where um, the bricks in the little fireplace area have been falling in. It's a sad, sad, sad thing that it has been deteriorating because it's a really cool piece of history.